guys, it's Sprout here, and I am back with another free OC. You guys really enjoyed the last one I did, so I figured I would go ahead and just keep making them. So this character, the generator, um, created Frostfish. Frostfish is a burly, smoky colored cat with eyes the color of the sea and gray model in their pelt. They are known to be a curious kitty pet and 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 a indecisive hunter and so i was really inspired by this and i was like okay i'm thinking of some like weird kitty pet that is like really curious about clan life but is not like a very good hunter because he's indecisive and so like either he gets kicked out of the clan or like just gives up and goes back i don't know i thought he would either make a really cool kitty pet based character or you could have a river clan you know if um i did river clan because fish i figured i don't know fish frost fish his i don't his kitty pet name could be you know frost or fish and if you wanted to make him a clan cat you because you can always change the name but anyway so that was kind of my like inspiration behind him i wasn't sure what malted meant um i didn't look it up but to me i just took it as kind of like splotches um, I really wanted to, oh, his white feet are so cute. I made this care, like, I actually did this speed paint, um, or not speed paint. The speed paint I did tonight, and then this making the character I did a few days ago. Um, oh, I made his little, like, uh, butt fluff white. He, I was actually really happy with how this guy came out. Um, my goal is to make pretty simple characters that way people can easily recreate them but still very like unique and memorable for them and other people um like when you have a really big clan sometimes if the cats all kind of look the same because we have limited colors limited morphs and stuff and it can be hard to tell cats apart especially now that like for me i almost always hide um usernames and before the update where now we can pick thank you pav if you are watching this or whoever did that thank you uh because i was so stressed i would always have it hidden because it was too much like text but so having a unique oc i think is important in the role play it just makes for a more fun role play uh so i tried to make this guy pretty different he has a little short face i don't know if maybe he's some type of fancy cat that you know escaped and tried to become a warrior i always um liked that like plot idea um of like a really fancy show cat escaping but what am i doing now oh his accessory his scar color i don't think i gave him any scars oh i think my game actually messes up no 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 it doesn't I gave him dark whiskers. Oh, the all white tail is so pretty. Um, I figured that's where like the frost could come in. Um, oh wait, did I change it? No, I think I ended up doing all. Oh, and one little black tail. <laughs> one little black tail. I love it. Oh, I really like this design actually. He's cute. I'm trying to remember if I leave his. I guess I do. Okay, I guess at the end of his tail, he has a black tip, which is cool, which is interesting. And uh, doing my little circle. This one, I'm pretty sure, doesn't have any DLC. Um, the last one wasn't supposed to, but I, I didn't realize that the pelt color I used was DLC. Um, I try not to because, you know, I want people to be able to use this uh, OC. And so yes you can use this oc yes you can change stuff about them like yes you can use the art at the end of this video as your icon anywhere um i just ask that you leave credit or type in a description you know credit if it crops it um speaking of icon if you is this, if this is your first video um i also do a speed paint of the character the free character who is frost fur or frost fish and I, um, I like to include the icon because, like, if someone, you know, wants, like, a character, it's like a whole package, you know? I, I, um, I don't talk about it a lot, but, like, the furry fandom was a big part of my life, and I feel like it's, like, 
the same with a character like a fursona where it's like you have an icon and you have a character you can kind of like represent yourself um like if someone wanted to use this on deviantart they absolutely could uh, you just have to accept that other people also might be using this icon and this character but you know it's just like one big happy family so don't get upset if you see anyone using this character if anything be excited because they're a sprout fan and you can make a new friend i've been rambling a lot let me go i'm gonna put on some funky music for this funky little fish friend and if you like this feel free to subscribe i do a lot of content like this i do a lot of roblox warrior cat content and art and uh, i will see you guys later bye